The new hex editor extension adds basic hex viewing and hex editing support into VS Code. Here I've already installed this extension, so let's go take a look at it in a text file first. The hex editor extension also supports binary files. So here you can see that the file is open in VS Code's normal text editor. To open the hex editor instead, I'm just going to open the command palette with Control shift p or Command shift p and say hex, and we want the hex editor open file command here. When I run this, you can see that the view has now switched to a hex view. So I have all the hex data for this file here, all the memory offsets, and then a decoded preview of the text over in the right-hand column here. I can just browse through the entire file. If I want to see more details about one of the entries, I can just click on one of the cells here. And in, over here in the data inspector, I can actually see how this value would be interpreted in various formats. So uh, in int8, uh, utf8, all these different formats here, I can use the arrow keys to just navigate through there. Now, of course, I can also now make edits to the file. So let's say I'm going through the file and I find a value that I want to change, such as this here. I can just type a new hex value. So I'm going to say 50 as the new hex value. And I can also type over here on the decoded text side of things. So if I want to change this 1 to a 2, I can just type 2 here. And now I've made the change. The changed cells are being highlighted in this bright yellow color. Undo and redo, of course, work. So I can undo and redo just like that. And then once I'm done making changes, I can just hit save. And now the file has been written to disk. To switch back to VS Code's normal text view, I'm going to open up the command palette with Control shift p Command shift p and say Reopen with, so View, Reopen Editor with, and switch back to the text editor. And sure enough, my two changes have been correctly applied. Now, of course, the hex editor also works with binary files. So here is an image file. I'm going to open up the uh, view here and say View, Reopen Editor with, and switch to the hex editor. And now I have a view of the binary file. So I can just browse through the file. You can see the file header and then a bunch of file contents. Let's skip to somewhere here. And I'm just going to make a quick change that will break things to show that this is working. So I've made a change and saved it. And I'll say reopen editor with, switch back to the image preview. And sure enough, my change has been applied. So that's a quick look at the new hex editor extension for VS Code. It's still in development, so we're busy adding new features and fine tuning the user experience. But give it a try if you ever want to view or edit binary data directly within VS Code.